Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, welcome. I am so excited for today's video. I am doing a Walmart haul. If you have been to my channel before, you know I love a good Walmart find a good walmart dress a good walmart staple the price is just always right and the quality has really come a far way because i remember when i used to shop at walmart when i was young it did not used to be this same quality so if you are interested let's go ahead and get right into the video okay i'm trying to see where the best place to film at if you are new here you will recognize a new house I'm not in the same house anymore, guys. I moved, and honestly, it's awesome, but it's also stressful because I have to fill this whole house up with new decor, which is like totally a first world problem, but it's expensive. It's expensive. Now, if I was a rich baddie who um, had all the money in the world, this place would be furnished already because I know exactly what I like. I just can't afford it, you know? Okay, I think we're gonna go like, I don't know, I don't know where I should go. Where's the best light in here? Let's go look around. Okay, this is the situation that we have to work with. If you see my bulky camera and roadie mic setup, it's because this camera does not have a mic place, like to mount your mic. So I'm holding it and I'm praying that the audio comes out good. So we're just gonna, yeah, we're just gonna work like this and I'm gonna talk because I really like these styles of videos. So first off, is this beautiful scoop neck dress. I did not think I was gonna like this as much as I do, but it fit honestly like a glove. I think I got a small and it is so cute. I love the little ruffle at the bottom, very summery, and I always need a good dress to wear and I feel like this one is perfect because it can go with a lot of different occasions. So here's the detail in the back. I love this little open area for your back. You tie this right here, so I made a really cute bow. And I love the length on this. It is so flowy, so insanely comfortable. I love the little back area where they leave that exposed. I'm not wearing a normal bra with this, but I feel like I'm able to get away with it. But if you are a little bit bigger chested than I am, you could wear the little stickies and be good to go because the back does have that little opening right there. I love how also on the straps, I don't know if you can see it, but they also have the little adjustable straps so you can tailor this if you are a little bit shorter if you're, or if you are a little bit taller. 10 on 10, love this dress. It fits so nicely. It's also like a really nice, not linen-y material. I, I don't know what you would call this material, so it gets wrinkled a little bit. It almost feels like a, um, like a white color shirt. Like very, very, very nice material for Walmart. I'm really impressed. I love this. I wanna go back and get it in more colors because I think it comes in two colors. And I think the other color is actually like a darker color. So you could pull it off maybe a little bit more during the fall. I think I paid like 30 bucks for this. I will have everything linked down below for y'all just in case I don't remember the exact prices, but. Okay guys, next I wanna mention this No Boundaries bag. It is so cute. It is literally $15 and look how cute it looks with this outfit. I can't get enough. It is the perfect little clutch. It kind of reminds me of like a designer bag and it comes in multiple colors. So go snag this while you can because I feel like these are gonna sell out so quickly. And then these sunglasses, let me see if I can show you without like blinding you. So these are like a really beautiful rose gold color. Here, let me go right here and see if that's a better but it has the reflection on the other side. Like you can see, you can see yourself through the glass frame, which is perfect because I don't like when you can see my eyes through my sunglasses, but these are so chic, so cute. I feel like they go perfectly with this outfit and they're so affordable as well. Walmart has the best sunglasses. Do not sleep on their sunglass section. Next time you're in Walmart, go check them out. I guarantee you, you will find one that you like. 
Okay guys, so we switched locations because this lighting was so much better and this mirror, but look how cute this little dress is. I believe I paid like 10 or 12 bucks for it and it is so up my alley. It's a little wrinkled right now, but just disregard that because if you steam it, it honestly will look fantastic. This dress is cool because it has pockets. Here, let me show you if I can get my hand in. So it's really nice if you need to hide some like snacks or something, really great for that. It came in so many different colors. I actually wanted the beige one, but it was out of my size. So I had to get this really beautiful pastel green. Very summery, but I love it. If you got one of the darker colors, you could definitely transition this into fall and wear some like boots with it and maybe a jean jacket and you are set. But I also love that you don't see like your spaghetti strap bra here. It's thick enough to cover that. And it's honestly so comfy. I'm wearing mine with tennis shoes because this is usually how I would pair it if I need a quick little day dress and wanted to be comfy, but still wanted to be like kind of sporty cute. So okay, you're all gonna die at this next outfit because it's really putting me in the fall mood. I love it. This is the perfect transition to fall. It's the perfect like little outfit to work. First, let's talk about this little knit sweater. I feel like this is the perfect transition to fall because it is sleeveless, but you can pair this with a white like collared uh, long sleeve blouse in the winter to get the full use out of it since it is short sleeve. I also love that it's v-neck. It looks very like grandpa-ish, but I am really into it. It's a little wrinkled right now, but uh, a little steaming action will help that. I love the link too, cause I'm wearing this with leggings and I'll tell you which leggings these are in a bit, but I like how it's a little bit longer. Like it's not like super short, like it's not super cropped like that, but you could also like make it cropped and wear with high waisted jeans. Oh my gosh, that would look so cute, but this is so affordable and it just came out and I feel like this is gonna sell out really quickly because of how versatile, how comfy and how affordable it is. Now I have it paired with the time and true leggings. These are honestly the best leggings. If you've never seen these leggings at Walmart and you are looking for a good pair of like leggings or work pants, these are amazing. It does have like a little band at the top and then it does have a little line running down which I think is so fancy. It makes the legging look a little bit elevated and like you paid more than 15 bucks for it. So really awesome pair of leggings. Like I said, only like 15 bucks, which is such a steal. And I just have it paired with some little chunky mules almost. And I feel like you can wear the bottoms and the top with so many different variations. It's just like a really good staple outfit. And I like to tuck my little sweater in just a little bit, just to give it a little dimension. But overall, I love this outfit so much. I would definitely wear this around October-ish when it starts to get a little cooler out and I can wear leggings without dying in the heat. Okay, also very excited about the next find. I know I keep saying that, but honestly, this is such a good cardigan under $20. Like it is insanely good quality. This is a time and true cardigan. I love the stitching on it. I like how like right here, it's a little bit different than the shoulders. So they actually put a little bit of thought into it and it just looks and feels really high end. I did get my traditional size small and it fits really, really nicely. Run to Walmart because these are gonna sell out so fast. I also love the length because I can wear this with like high-waisted jeans. It's like at the perfect length or I can wear it with just like a regular pair of pants and it's not too short. You know what I mean? Turned on the light so you could see it a little bit better, but fits really, really well. It fits my arms as well because I have really long arms and I feel like I can never find cardigans that fit my arms, but I love this. I also love how it unbuttons so you can open it and wear it open as well, like with a really cute outfit or with like a spaghetti top shirt. I love it so much. I'm definitely gonna get the use out of this and it's under 20 bucks. Okay, if you were into Walmart basics, you're gonna wanna check this out. It is so comfy. Amazon sells some of these, and then I saw that Walmart sold some, so I had to compare them. Of course, they're identical, and of course, Walmart is like half the price. I think these were like 12 bucks, maybe max like 14. They have so many different colors. I love the material. It's like a Skims, like spandexy material, and it has a built-in bra in it, so you don't gotta wear a bra because 
I hate wearing bras with spaghetti straps. It's just such a hassle to try and hide your bra. I love the length because I can wear it with high-waisted shorts. And I love this color. It's like a very purpley undertone, but it's also like a beige. I don't know. I'm loving. I also got a white one. It's like a light gray, I think is actually what it's called. And these are true to size. They fit really well. If you want a really good workout tee or just a tee to be comfy at home, these are awesome. They don't smush your boobs in either. Like they give you a nice little, you know, a little lift. I love these. Walmart is coming through with the basics. A couple of things going on here. First off, I have seen these little like tennis dresses all over TikTok and I've looked at a couple of them. They're a little expensive. Y'all be getting them from like Lululemon and uh, I needed a more affordable option just to see if I would even wear it. But this white one from Walmart is everything. I do wish this was a little lower. Like it kind of like fits like it's hugging up the top. I don't know. It's like weird. Like I wish this line wasn't there. I don't know. I just, it's not really like vibing with me, especially because my sports bra is like right here. I'm, I don't know if you can see the indention, but I wish they would have mirrored like a little bit lower chest area. That way it could have looked a little bit more cuter, but it's still so comfy. I got mine in a small and as you can tell, I'm a pretty tall girl. I am 5'7 for reference. So it does fit me a little bit short like especially in the back area. But the way I would wear this is with little leggings underneath. Like I have a little black pair of leggings. So you can actually use it to go play sports. Like you can go play tennis. You can like go to the grocery store. And it honestly just looks so cute. I love it. It was like 14 bucks and it's a really affordable way to get a little tennis dress if you've been seeing them. Like I have all over TikTok. So cute, they had a couple colors. Go get them quick because when I went to go grab this, the sizes were selling out so quickly. The star of the show is these faux Yeezys. Guys, these literally look just like Yeezys. It is insane. They're so comfortable as well. They're a little bit snug, but my sock is a little bit thicker. I did get my size eight, but I do think they have other colors. I mean, they're just so cute. I cannot believe Walmart's out here trying to rip off Yeezys. I mean, they look so similar. You wouldn't really know unless you like know Yeezys like really well. Like, I mean, look how similar they look. It is actually crazy to me. And these are a fraction of the cost of Yeezys. I mean, come on, these, I think these shoes were like 20 bucks. So you really can't beat the price and they're super comfy as well. I can't get over how cute these are. Like literally so comfortable. They even have like the thick little shoelace, just like the Yeezys. I mean, it's incredible how similar. I bet you the darker ones would look even more identical because you wouldn't be able to see like every little divot. But I thought that was so funny that they look like almost identical to Yeezys. So I had to pick them up and I had to put them to the test. So yeah, that was the end of my haul. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. It's been such a long time since I filmed, but I'm getting back at it and I'm so excited because I miss y'all. I miss YouTube. I miss these lengthy videos where I'm just talking with y'all so let me know what you want to have for the next video and i will be sure to get it up be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and hit that subscribe button if you want more videos like this like i mentioned before all the links are listed down below so if you like something in today's video go check out the links down there it'll take you straight to the product until next time guys bye